Hello my darlings and welcome to my channel. Today we're gonna have a candle wax reading but I made some uh, options for you here because it's a solar eclipse and a new moon at the same time. Uh, two in one. So I made a sun for you and a moon for you so you may choose one of those piles or you can watch both because they are uh, actually combined of, with the energy that's coming up in the upcoming days. Uh, this reading is timeless still because you know I don't know when you're gonna watch this reading but especially for people who are watching in April or do, during the next three months or so um, after the solar eclipse okay so uh, my question will be is what uh, will make you stand out or let me see I actually made not the question if I can find it now basically what will make you shine okay uh, what will stand out, what will be important uh, during this uh, solar eclipse in the uh, end the upcoming months for you? So what will shine through in your life? What will be clear? Okay, so let's start with pile number one. Hello pile one, whoever chose the yellow um, paper, the sun. Any information that I get, I will let you know. For some of you, um, you currently could be wondering about certain questions. Certain question is bothering you. Uh, some clarity you miss on and exactly this clarity will be shown to you I see a person that comes with you uh, to you with news either they will call you or let you know and they will actually tell you exactly how things are standing for others of you it may be some uh, documents maybe some court issue that you have and your lawyer maybe will call you and tell you exactly how things will be or what you um, dealing with could also be about a person if you're dealing with someone and you have um, strongly have a question about this connection whichever connection it is you will get straightforward answers so basically you will get an honest answer and not because everyone around you is honest right it's because the sun will open uh, this for you it's like they want it or not, they will be honest. Even if the situation or information is something you're not going to like. Okay, so if a person really is, for instance, okay, if if you thinking, oh, the, the, this person into me, they may tell you straightforward that they're not. Or they may straight straightforward tell you that, yes, they're interested and they want to date you. So whichever way it goes, it's good for you because it's it's the clarity you seek something wasn't clear will become clear of course not for all this is a general reading but you'll get your answer and from there you'll go but at least you wouldn't need to be in a hang mo mode or in a mode where you don't know what to do or in stagnation no it's gonna really push you forward your energy I see a person that's trying to choose between two things you may um, have, it's not just a choice, it's should I go right or left, should I do this or that, mm, you will be dealing with this question, why it shows me that? The answer will come to you when you will be speaking to some some person like you are gonna communicate maybe it's your friend your family member your loved one whoever they are your co-worker your boss i don't know depends on the question uh, you will be communicating with someone and they will give you the exactly um, 
again the clarity that you need should you choose right or left should you do this or that uh, somehow they will give you precise numbers even another uh, uh, possibility you trying to you you don't understand should you buy a house or not right now is this the right time or not and you will talk to um some maybe i don't know mortgage guy or um your you know bank person or somebody who deals with that uh, real estate and they will give you precise numbers or should you do something or not they will give you this clarity lots of career vibes here i see lots of impulse or um passion comes towards you're gonna invest a lot in your career uh in your business in some idea that you will be uh you know working on maybe even some collaboration with someone too for some you are uh creating something like even a statue i see a, a man uh, making something with their hands with clay maybe you're working with clay or you will be uh make maybe it's an uh somebody will order your uh, artwork right or will order something from you and you will be working on that as well um but what will be as the question of this reading what will make you shine is your brilliant work something you're doing very well here pal one and maybe even after that work or an art piece whatever you're doing you will become famous about it so you really working on something i don't know what exactly you're expressing but it's very good time to express your skills your knowledge maybe even show it to the world um i just heard be careful of your ego it is as well because it's sun energy because you may become popular all of a sudden and you wouldn't know what to do with it especially if you're not used to that but at the same time i see that some people will admire your work and it may push you towards something i even see um, a situation at uh, at work in an office if you work around many people right or a high-rise buildings maybe or a very big company uh, suddenly you will do a certain project or you will show yourself in a certain way where all the people around will notice you your boss will notice you more maybe even a brilliant work that you're going to do maybe even like if you are a doctor or a surgeon i don't know maybe you'll save someone i also heard be mindful towards your loved ones or your family because you may be too much into like doing other stuff and you kind of not forget but you're not gonna pay as much attention to people around you and they need your care they need your help or they just need your attention so be uh, mindful towards people that you care for for some of you because i see a monk here right uh, maybe during those months you will be working with from like within on yourself maybe even going on a certain retreat or place where you're going to be more alone or working on you not on someone else or something else and you will become more uh, wise more even spiritual maybe um, what will make you shine is your inner light your inner light will be shining especially if you've never done this before or you just right now going through spiritual awakening by the way welcome to people that are just realized uh, their spiritual awakening and uh, they seeking answers you in the right place <clears throat> empaths as well I see a very interesting collaboration of two people. Two people that come in from different backgrounds. Collaboration could mean anything, literally. 
romantic or not. Two people coming from completely different uh, backgrounds, different norms, they're, they're uniting. I see two people uniting here. In a very special way. Wow. And this solar eclipse, right, is between them. It's like it's making them more connected even or maybe a person that you're not as much connected to will become more connected to you and you're gonna see them investing more in this connection somebody will invest in a connection here more than usual uh, because of this solar um, eclipse and this sun energy and the new moon it's like a new approach to something that was already obvious I hear or to something that never really shined through expressiveness of feelings as well I also just heard look at the clock the clock will tell you when is the right timing to do something I say moment in time right you need to do something maybe you will be signing an important um, document Hopefully, you know, not in the upcoming weeks because of Mercury retrograde. But I heard that this solar eclipse is, and the new moon is so strong that no um, retrograde can hurt it, right? <laughs> so I wouldn't worry about that as much. But I do see that you will be, uh, for instance, if you will be signing a certain contract or uh, a document, the clock will, uh, the clock will confirm it. For some reason the clock I don't know it's a literal clock I don't know it's a specific certain timing I don't know if it's a synchronicity it could be any of it or maybe somebody will look at their clock I even I know sometimes people look at their hand but they have no clock which means you don't need this confirmation it's already um, it's already confirmed I feel like there is a TV, right? You know, there's in old times there was a certain TV and it's flying towards you. Uh, some interesting, why I want to say interesting, maybe even old news will be uh, reappearing in a new way. It's like old times will collide with new times, which is also maybe referring to the uh, retrograde that's, you know, happening right now. It's like old time is are collapsing with new times and it's good for some reason it's good I don't know what it is it's good like innovations maybe maybe, maybe some of you will create something that uh, if bef before was needed and now it's a new technology or something you not needed anymore or something from the old will be taken into the new Wow. Maybe new technology is coming. I don't, maybe it's like in general you hear the news that a new technology or new invention is happening. And it's will, it will be all, all over the world. Like the sun, it will shine through. I also see a panther running. I don't know if it means something to you. Uh, I don't know if you're a member somewhere or... Is this you or this is someone else? Someone's trying to catch your tail. So basically, um, because this uh, 
this time is very strong you may be active like a panther you're gonna be fast in things you maybe you're gonna grow fast maybe financially you're gonna grow fast maybe you will become popular maybe your relationship will uh, you know accelerate right and someone's trying to still catch your tail somebody's trying to you know hold you back or say wait wait where are you going why so fast or like what's going on so someone will try to catch up with you or try to uh, follow you try to even maybe stop you from certain um, success but not because they i don't see the energy that they they uh, mean not well to you or they they do it on purpose it's more like they're like why am i left behind why why they do it so fast and I cannot? Some, some even jealousy may arise, but at the same time, sadness of some person or people that uh, kind of they cannot catch you anymore. They, if before they were kind of at least some somewhat following you, now they cannot. It's like it's not in their power anymore because you are a panther. You are very fast. I hear blue panther, black panther for some reason. So uh, let's see, is there anything else that will make you shine, that will make you uh, outstanding? I see a love letter. If you're waiting for a love letter, love message, you will get it within the next 10 days. You will get uh, clarity about some person that maybe, maybe you in a pause with someone. Some people like waiting for a response or a, or a love offer or it's not really an offer. It's more like uh, there is no contact or communication. You will you will get the message. You will get the message. Don't worry. I also see two birds uh, sitting on a branch. I, I hope you see it too with the little tails. <laughs> How cute is that? Uh, some of you will have a date or some uh, spending good time with your partner, maybe in nature or somewhere where there are birds even. Looking at the sky, talking about life. I see very, very positive. Um, <clears throat> very positive moment. What else I see here? It's like this huge, I don't know if it's a, it's like a person in a cloud, right? It's pushing the other person, like they're boxing them. And I want to say, you may get a wake up call from God, from the universe. At certain moment of time, if especially for those people who will be feeling weak or they don't want to do anything or they disappointed in something you will get a wake-up call and it may even hurt you a bit because this time is not to be stressed or um, lazy this is a time of solar eclipse it's time when things your fate is you know your fate is around and you don't want to miss out on that or you don't want to um, you know not use this energy for your own benefits and I'm not saying you have to purposely make yourself energetic, no, but there, for some people you will feel sad or negative or uh, unbalanced and the universe, God, whoever you believe in, it will kick you and, you know, say, listen, wake up, wake up, even may even throw, throw a problem at your face and you'll have to deal with it. And you're like, wow, I'm not ready. I'm, I'm ready to lay down. I'm ready to, you know, cry right now. Or I'm ready to be sad today. I'm not ready for this. But that's going to be a wake-up call. It will shower in your face. If you're not going to... Uh, if you're going to be too long into some depression or, or sadness, the universe will make you wake up. Okay? Wow, such a beautiful energy. I love the, the whole vibe of it. Uh, take advantage of this, guys. Many of you will become, as I said, popular. Some of you will be uh, given the clarity that you always wanted. 
Some of you will, you know, be great at your career, brilliant work. Some inventions are happening. There's so many things and it works and like within the next six months, this energy, but especially the first three months after solar eclipse, it's going to be very uh, powerful time. So take this time to um, outstand uh, um, somewhere to, you know, run after your goals. You are a panther, remember, you are fast. Not everyone can, you know, even uh, get to that uh, acceleration as you may get. Some of you will become suddenly wealthy uh, or you will get a good money, right? So um, if you really feel what I'm saying, if you feel this energy, this vibe, and the energy right now, I think it's a um, uh, new moon in Aries. This it's time to start, or it's time to do something. It's there's no time for uh, just you know leisure or doing nothing. Yes, there will be time when you will be just hanging out, maybe with your loved ones, with your partner, with uh, your family. Yes, but there's gonna be just bits of pieces between. It's like a break between work. It's like a, a lunch time. <laughs> It's like people in offices, they usually have like one hour or half an hour of lunch break. That's what, that's what it is. The rest of the time you will be investing in your life. This is all for you guys. And when you wouldn't want to do it, the universe will make you. Okay? Thank you guys. Thank you, pile number one. I love you all. And I'm going to pile two. If you wish to look for pile two, we'll look at the moon energy, new moon energy. <laughs> Um, or just you feel like you want to watch the whole reading, you're welcome. <clears throat> Hello, pile two, whoever chose the moon. Uh, as I s I'm set to pile one, I would recommend to watch the whole reading eventually. Maybe some information will be valuable for you. But let's see um, what you need to know, what will make you um, stand out or what will make you shine, what will make during this uh, solar eclipse and a new moon, what will be important Wow, pile number two. Uh, for pile two, I feel like, you know what I feel? Not for all of you, but for some of you, this specific message, right? If it's not for you, just continue watching and ignore this part. Some of you, it's like, I see people that were like um, partying, hanging out, doing some stuff, uh, being active more with friends or... Um, I feel, I, I see like kind of people that like energized and uh, around, the, like they're all over the place. And the universe um, at that time, the universe is like, okay, this is great. You had your time. You had your dance. Now it's time to work. But when I say work, not literal work. Not, not for all at least. I, I mean like uh, it's time to... Uh, Take this energy, like, on yourself, and make something good out of it. I don't know what it means, guys. It makes something good. Imagine if all this energy that goes around you, maybe you have many friends, many people around you. Um, a, a lot of people that maybe you communicate with in some way, you, you need it or not. And now, the universe says, now it's time to take it back. Not, doesn't mean you don't have to like be connecting to anyone, no. But take it back and imagine if all this energy will get to something one, to one thing. For instance, uh, maybe you're going to be investing in something, like in a relationship. If before it was all over the place, your energy, now you're going to specifically work on a relationship. For others of you, you will specifically be working on creating uh, the best life for yourself. Maybe creating a business, investing your energy in a certain project. Uh, all of those things that were, if before you were multitasking, multitasking, doing several things at the same time. Now, you take everything back at you and you just put it in one thing that will be so important eventually. Eventually, it will bring you to, uh, it's like one part of, you know, not one, I mean like third part part of your problems will be just covered. It's like you will be covering something maybe you couldn't cover before. Okay, maybe you will be working on paying off your loan in two, three months 
completely or paying off your home and you will never come back to this anymore paying off your mortgage i don't know paying off your car you you will be um investing into something important that eventually will give you a certain sense of ease like i did it i worked hard i did this part i'm done with it and i'm happy wow now the wax is on the table if someone's crying right now or someone's upset that um maybe something didn't work out like i see some people maybe you put lots of effort and it didn't work out it was just a tryout uh it will work eventually don't worry what else for pile two what else they need to know i see a fish or a dolphin a fish could represent uh money uh like very good bonus or some money that coming in uh, but dolphins also represent intelligence kindness um, maybe you will have someone that will care for you a lot and will be helping you during this road you may have a person around you either you already have them or you will okay another thing i see that um mm -hmm. for some of you if especially for those who are single right now you will be dating if your dating phase has ended at a certain point of time or you don't want to date anyone or you feel like you're doing great or you're concentrating on something else um this solar eclipse and a new moon will show you or like will uh even make you <laughs> start going out and talking to different people to investing in a um, a future productive relationship and to to go there you will you will need to have choices so you will be i even see maybe you're gonna be on tinder i don't know somewhere where i see many people i see profiles of people maybe you like to date online or to talk to people online but you will be investing in your personal life and again, if you don't want any of it or you, it's not relatable to you in any way, just ignore this message. But somebody needed to hear this. Uh, wow, does it look like a crab? Maybe you will be eating a crab soon or you will be um, experiencing a vacation. Hear me out, pile two, for some of you. You will be experiencing because there is lots of fish and like not even fish but uh, how do you call it uh seafood i hear seafood and uh, maybe you're gonna be eating some seafood soon but i see that you're gonna be eating it in place where you've never been before either it's a new country uh ever that you're going to visit new city maybe new restaurant even if it's around you it's new or it's you've never been there before uh, but it's related to certain seafood if you tell me right now i don't eat seafood or it's never around me you'll be surprised maybe even your taste will change or you're just going to be around that vibe that energy doesn't necessarily mean you have to eat it but some vibe of a seafood of uh, ocean or i don't know near some waters um i don't know palm trees and so forth wow this is beautiful somebody will have a nice vacation here or uh, weekend um, long weekend like getaway that it's gonna be a very memorable for you okay what else okay what else for pile number two here what else you need to know If you worry, listen, some of you, I see a person on your mind, right? If you worry about someone, some person, do they like me or not? Will they do something or not? Will they contact me or not? Uh, is this my person or not? Um, this need of even thinking of that will fade during this time of a solar eclipse and i would recommend to watch pile one for you especially for those people because uh some clarity will come to you either it's going to be your inside uh, like your intuitively you will realize 
yes they are or yes no they're not so you things will sort uh, be sort out you're not gonna be wondering anymore if you're wondering now it's not gonna be a concern anymore later on lots of hearts and uh, even hearts did you yeah wow look how how interesting the picture became uh, like a lollipops I don't know why uh, lots of lollipops maybe you're gonna be in a candy store shop I don't know uh, <laughs> okay some things I cannot say here but there is a song just came to my mind about a candy shop and lollipop whatever oh my god I don't even know why I'm saying that but okay uh, maybe you're gonna have some intimacy with someone here uh, or thinking about that or someone is thinking about you here um, to have intimacy with you but at the same time it could mean that you're gonna have a spend a very fun time somewhere I even see a party maybe it's even a um, birthday party or maybe baby shower where there will be lots of toys literally and lollipops maybe right be attending some party you will be invited to such party where there's lots of sweets uh, or just sweet time with people around you I love your energy pile two uh, pile one is like crazy <laughs> in a good way but you are more um, a little bit more will be will become not yet maybe more relaxed and um, reserved in a good way okay you're not gonna be all over the place not anymore but at the same time you're not gonna be just uh, sitting around as we said or crying okay I see a mouse right like a Mickey Mouse but the point is you may have either it's a friend or somebody you talk to but this is not romantic no this is you have some communication with someone that kind of um, either rocky right now maybe you have your differences or somebody turned their back at you or you did at them uh, this re situation I hear this situation was needed to be you needed to have a certain misunderstanding or pause with this person for certain future uh revelations understanding of of life even if you right now um in no contact with some person or you're not understanding each other or you will have some conversation that's not going to be as nice right this is not an actual argument no it's just like you don't feel like you want to talk to them they don't maybe feel like that they want to talk to you for some time right that's okay this is needed for some um it has spiritual meaning behind it it's not just about you and this person it has something more that eventually you will say wow and now i understand why this happened or now i understand why i felt that way it's like I, why i i feel disconnected even yeah even like you we may feel disconnected emotionally with someone that's normal let it be let this moment pass um what else pile number two needs to know about them about your life about the solar eclipse and the new moon i also noticed it looks like a tree uh, i want to say uh, you may be connecting to your ancestral roots in the upcoming months even weeks you maybe will get in messages from your ancestors they are actually carrying you i want to tell you they protecting you they uh they even in front of you i hear they will be so proud of your um progress some progress if for example for pile one the progress will be very fast for you it's more quiet progress that not everyone will see and until you actually get to the goal 
So it's more like quiet progress that not everyone may notice. And uh, you're just gonna go with a certain flow and your ancestors, they, they're keeping an eye on you. They are like uh, activating some of your, oh my God, I just heard. They activate will be activating some of your skills and gifts. And um, you will re be realizing um, things about yourself even all of a sudden you're like, wow, I, I can do that. Wow, I want to try that. Wow, I did so good uh, the other day at work. Um, wow, I even forgot I had this knowledge or I once read this book and it gave me some um, help, like guidance. So you will be surprised about your uh, skills, gifts, knowledge. But this is your ancestors. They will. It's like they will, like shine at that, like or like they like like a moon, right? They will give you a little light of a new moon, and say, "Well, look here, look, pile two. Uh, pay your attention over here." Then like, oh, uh, pile two. Pay your attention over here. You can do that as well, you know. And this is all like intuitively will be happening, all intuitively. Or like you are working, for instance, you're working at a restaurant or you working in some um, busy place. And then suddenly like somebody needs help. And you come in towards them and you're like, wow, you, you should do this, this or that. And they do it and like, well, how did you know this skill? Like, I don't know, I just read it on the internet or I just saw my mom or dad doing this. And they're like, wow, I never even thought this is a solution. But that's, that's your ancestors, like, giving you those um, uh, events, little situations around you will be happening where you, like, uh, you will be exploring about your own skills. And this eventually may even change your um, career path. You're going to say, wow, if I can do that, why don't I choose this or that? Or why don't I change my direction? Why don't I start this business if I'm good at it? Maybe I have this skill. Maybe I just need to open it more. So pay attention to little details, little uh, situations, events that will be happening to you. That it, at the same time, you're not really involved into that. It's not your problem. But you kind of was there. You kind of realized something about yourself. You kind of saw a certain gift, extra gift in you. That's what I see. And uh, is there anything else for pile number two? Pile two, you will be mixing colors. What else is going to be very uh, bright and noticeable during this um, solar eclipse and a new moon? You will be um, combining colors and people will see, for example, maybe you, you will change your lipstick color if you're a woman, right? Or uh, you will change, uh, like you will uh, dye your hair in a different color. Uh, maybe the clothes that you wore before were a certain color, now you're going to wear different clothes. Uh, people will notice this change. They may not literally notice it, but they will notice that something has changed in you. So you may, or maybe the way you will be uh, connecting some colors, some accessories, um, the style of yours, like you will be interact. I even see a colorful tattoo that somebody will do, not just black or just one color. It's going to be mixture of several colors. Maybe you're going to do some flower that's going to, you know, um, on your body something something about colors will be important let me see if you by the way as usual see something else this is your message or you can write it in the comment section I see many images but I cannot go towards all of them uh, I guess therefore each individually for some, you are growing a tree you're on top of a certain tree. Maybe you will be planting some seeds. Um, maybe it's it's a little business that you will start and then uh, uh, like watering it, watering it. 
so it all may start small for pile two it all may start small that eventually will grow okay and uh, I don't know why I never touched the star I want to say your wish <clears throat> something about your wish yes it's still kind of a little bit further than you think but you almost reaching towards this wish it's like all this work that you're gonna put uh, uh, like the, it's taking you towards your uh, most important wish so the upcoming months will be a work that you will be investing in right it's getting you towards your wish you know what I mean that's what I had for you guys uh, happy solar eclipse and a new moon I hope you're doing great I'm sure you will I love you all and I'll see you in my other videos. Bye-bye.